sweater. You would get rules, you know? Uh, uh, Mr. Wallace, I have a secret I can't tell you. You want to tell me now or later? Maddie just left for New York. Judy drove her to the station. Oh, New York? What for? She thinks you're not the man she thought you were, but I bet she'd reconsider. Oh, so that's what she thinks, huh? Meanwhile, she said you should walk off the ski jump. Actually, Captain, Miss Haynes got a telegram. Well, what did it say? Oh, Wallace isn't the man you thought he was? Leave town? Well... Take five, please. I, uh, took the liberty of borrowing what I have with so. Oh, the Regency Room. I like that. Ditching for Bob for the big time. God damn it, Captain. I think you're making a tactical error. What time I to talk? What all I've got? I think she just got confused somehow. Bob, one of the jobs of a commanding officer is knowing how to assess people. In my assessment, Miss Haynes doesn't have an ounce of guff in her. I think she's in love with you. You're in love with her, and there's just been a misunderstanding. And if you don't go off and chase after her, you're a damn fool. I think so, too. General, could you arrange a car to take me to New York? It's already waiting outside. You know, sister, you are a prize. Wait till you hear me sing. <laughs> Later, Susie. Have a safe trip, buddy. Good luck, son.